Hi, I'm Otis Dealey, technophile, and I love tech. I also love my food. Wait a minute. There's technology around that could put this banana skin to good use. Let's take a trip to Bangladesh and see what some boffins over there have come up with and see what they could do with this. Mmm, nice bike trailer. Wouldn't mind having a go on that. I wonder what it's for. <sighs> Bumpy ride. Ah, now I get it. The trailers are used to collect the rubbish. Every morning, these guys head out and collect rubbish from people's houses. Then, these women sort the food waste from other stuff, stuff which they can reuse or recycle. These food scraps get mixed up with the water and go into the main part of the digester where the microbes get to work. Hey, is that my banana? The microbes love it in here. They have everything they need to be happy and get cracking with anaerobic digestion. Nice warm temperatures, enough moisture, hardly any oxygen, and the right pH. Not too acidic, not too alkaline. They just get on with munching away on the food to make fertilizer and something else. Um, hold on, what's that? Sounded like a microbe fart to me. Oops, <laughs> there's another one. <clears throat> No wonder it's so smelly in here. Of course, microbes don't really fart, but they do produce lots of methane as they digest the food scraps. After 15 days of this, the food waste is finally broken down and the microbes work is done. The broken down food makes great fertilizer and is used in compost or slurry. But what happens to all that <coughs> methane biogas that is produced by the microbes farts? Well, that does get used, Let's follow it and see where it ends up. It goes along here. Mind the cow, down there. Ah, to local houses like this one where it's used to cook dinner. So, fuel and fertilizer from kitchen waste. I told you these boffins in Bangladesh were something else. Biogas digesters are a fantastic example of tech justice in action. Tech Justice is about giving everybody access to technology that is essential for life. To see more examples of Tech Justice in action, take a look at my other two videos, Pump It Up and Beat the Flood.